In this video, we're going to show you how to turn photos like this into sun prints. Sun print paper is a special type that's based on the cyanotype process and it's sensitive to sunlight. You can pick it up online or from some craft shops. When you expose it to bright daylight, areas that block the sun's light show up in white and the rest of the paper turns a vibrant blue. You don't need a dark cream, any fancy kit or extensive knowledge of film processing to make a sun print. Technically, you don't even need a camera for this project. First, you'll need to choose one of your images to turn into a sun print. It's best to pick a high contrast photo that isn't too busy or detailed. Invest the tones in editing software such as Photoshop, then print it out in black and white. We tried out a dark tree trunk against a bright sky background. Once you've got your negative printed out, you're ready to expose the paper. For this step, we're going to set up our prints in the shade, otherwise the paper is likely to start exposing too quickly. Grab a bowl or tray, a big bottle of water, some sticky tape and your sun print kit. You're now ready to expose the paper. Fill up a developer container with water and set it to one side. Grab some sun print paper, making sure its size roughly matches your negative. We used an A4 kit here. Most kits come with plexiglass, but you can also use glass or plastic from a cheap photo frame if not. Place your negative on top of the sun print paper, making sure it's blue side up. Line up the glass, negative, sun print paper and a piece of cardboard, then use a few bits of tape to secure it all together and stop it sliding around. Then, let it bask in the sun for about 20 minutes and check the exposure of the paper by lifting a corner back from the frame. When the edges are white, it's fully exposed. On a cloudy day, you might need to leave it an extra five minutes. When there's a clear imprint of your image on the paper, rinse your sun print. Take it off the back of the glass, remove the tape and place it into the water tray. It will change from a negative to a positive before your eyes. Take your print out of the water after a few minutes and let it dry naturally. The colours will deepen as the paper dries. Avoid touching the surface of the paper and ideally peg it up or lie it flat somewhere. If you want to, you can also place objects such as leaves or feathers directly onto the sun print paper. Just place them between the paper and the acrylic sheet, then follow the same exposure method. So why not give sun printing a go yourself? All you need is some sunshine, water and a bit of imagination.